In Sarpy County for Veterans Day, there were two memorial dedications for those who sacrificed so much for our country, helping to make sure that they're not forgotten. Six News' Joe Harris checked them out and tells us about them. Omaha resident Rex Gruber says he was a Marine serving in Korea when he earned his two Purple Hearts. I got shot three times, two bullets in a thigh and one in my ankle bone. Army vet Terry Menarik says he earned his in Vietnam. Each time we were in uh, combat and uh, that's how I got wounded. Uh, some of it was shrapnel and so on. Both were at the ceremony American Legion Post 32 put on dedicating the new Purple Heart Memorial at Veterans Park in Papillion Saturday. Show them the respect um, and give them a place and uh, to come and for, you know, hopefully remembrance in a good way. Those in attendance appreciated it. This is very, very special to Purple Heart recipients. The memorial in back of us is truly beautiful. Meanwhile, veterans of foreign wars post 2280 rededicated a new Vietnam War monument at Washington Park in Bellevue. VFW members say the last one had been damaged and was deteriorating for several years. They just went and just got some damage from vehicles and it, it was beyond repair so we coordinated with somebody, raised some funds and bought a new monument to replace the old one with. And, and he says it's important to have Vietnam memorials so those veterans, like Earl W. Armstrong Jr., can get more recognition. We're getting to the point where we start recognizing our Vietnam veterans and giving them the due uh, uh, respect and uh, encouragement, just so to speak, uh, and let them realize that, you know, that their efforts there in Vietnam we're worthy of uh, being recognized and appreciated. On your side in Sarpy County, Joe Harris, 6 News. Wiseman also says his VFW post has adopted Washington Park and that Vietnam Memorial is only the first of several that they're going to be giving upgrades to.